Brno is a Central European commercial and industrial centre with a thousand years of history and a number of important cultural sites. Brno is also an important university city with plenty of qualified specialists and a strong manufacturing tradition. Steam engines began to be manufactured in Brno as early as the 19th century, steam turbines from the beginning of the 20th century. The Ecole Group is also part of this industrial tradition, where highly experienced workers from the energy sector have found their employment in their respective fields. Its history dates back to 1991. In its more than 30 years of experience in the power industry, the Ecole Group has supplied customers in many countries with more than 80 steam turbines of various types with outputs varying between 2 and 70 megawatts. Since 2015, Ecole has been part of the major global group Shanggu Power. Now let's have a look at the main milestones in the history of Ecole in more detail. The year 1991 is not only the date of Ecole's foundation, but also the time for the development of new combustion chamber solutions for turbines at compressor stations of the transit pipeline. Combustion chamber reconstructions were the first commissions of the newly established Ecole. In 1994, a complex reconstruction of two combustion turbines at the Seidar compression station in Germany was started. Apart from the repair of the turbines and the modification of the combustion chambers, this also included the replacement of the intake tract, recuperation exchanger, and the reconstruction of the oil system. Extensive reconstruction was started on the regeneration exchangers of the compressor stations. This included the replacement of the original plate heat exchangers, which were at the end of their service lives. Ecole was commissioned to design and manufacture a steam turbine of its own design. This was the 12 MW condensing turbine for the Colleen heating plant. Ecole Brno can provide all components for power generating equipment, which create a power plant as a whole. In recent years, we have focused not only on deliveries of individual steam turbines, combustion turbines and boilers, but also on complete units that constitute power plants, producing power and heat, that is, combined production, which provides the customer with much better value. This year, a tender was won for the supply of a steam turbine for an Egyptian customer. With this contract, Ecole entered the field of power for sugar refineries. In 2007, the implementation division was transformed into a subsidiary firm of Eco Energo SRO. New production and assembly rooms were built for Eco Energo. The company can make and assemble up to 10 steam turbines per year. The production base is located in the hall of the new complex in Brno. The hall is equipped with modern machine tools, which enable the machining of the main components of steam turbines, the rotors and casings, with the company's own equipment. There is enough space here for assembly, where the prepared equipment is assembled and subjected to prescribed quality tests. The company employs blue-collar staff with the top qualifications for machining and first-class fitters for assembling steam and combustion turbines. In addition to manufacturing new equipment, the company also provides the repair and maintenance of devices in operation in line with the customer's prescribed plan for repair and inspection. The extent of repairs is not limited to the type of turbine or producer.
The company offers to provide a retrofit designed to adapt turbine units to the changing operating conditions of customers. ECOL was successful in the competition at the International Engineering Fair in Brno and was awarded the gold medal for the rotor of unified 8 megawatt steam turbine for the Shugana refinery in Nobaria, Egypt. The ECOL group has received numerous awards and patents that demonstrate the positive impact of its products on economical and environmentally friendly operation. In 2009, the boiler division was established in Poly. This division is responsible for the design, production and supply of steam and hot water boilers for the combustion of noble liquid and gas fuels, all combinations of technological gases, coal, biomass and waste. Furthermore, it offers boilers for the use of waste heat. This enables ECOL to supply the main parts of a power plant, which means steam turbines and boilers and EPC projects. This year, a power plant was supplied by Ecol to Nile Sugar Factory in Egypt. Another example of a turnkey project supplied by Ecol is the power plant of the Nile Sugar Factory in Egypt. The order covers the boiler system, the steam turbines and all systems creating the accessories of the sugar refinery power plant processing sugar beet. This year, a power plant was opened, which was supplied by Ecol to the RU2 plant for processing potassium salts for the company Belarus Gali in the Belarus town of Soligorsk. The technology supplied provides the source of heat energy for drying potassium salts. There is a 7 megawatt solar combustion turbine whose flue gases are conveyed via a flue gas duct to the drying drums of potassium salts or to a waste heat boiler where technological steam is produced for other operations in other places. The flue gas ducts are equipped with additional burners, allowing the temperature of flue gases to be increased if required. Ecol carried out the design, delivery, installation and startup of a turnkey biomass power plant at the Veolia site in Sviatnov for the company Enego Future. Wood chips are used as fuel. An example of such a comprehensive order is the construction of the environmentally friendly biopower plant in the premises of the Friedek Mistek heating plant in Sviadnov. It's a facility for producing electricity and thermal energy. The Ecol type RKF26 boiler is used here, which produces up to 29 tons of steam per hour. It burns biomass, wood chip to be exact. The boiler burns up to 90,000 tons of wood chip every year. This is transported by truck to the boiler from a covered depot with sufficient supply of fuel. All processes in the warehouse, including the grab and chip conveyor, are completely automated and can be monitored using the CCTV system from the control center. Ecol's precisely controlled steam turbine is at the heart of the new power plant. 
The power output of the turbine reaches 5.8 megawatts. The forecast amount of electricity generated is 36 gigawatt hours. The construction of the entire bioplier plant took an extremely short time, only 10 months. The state-of-the-art technology used by ECO provides for immediate and environmentally friendly replacement over 18,000 tonnes of fossil fuels or 340 wagons of black coal in a single year. Moreover, this reduces emissions of carbon dioxide into the atmosphere by over 40,000 tonnes a year. Therefore, it is highly efficient and environmentally friendly combined source with a good return on investment for the operator. Ecol was successful in the competition Czech Energy and Ecology project with its Bayer power plant in Sviernov. This project was officially called Greening the Source of District Heating in Friedek Mistek. In 2015, Ecol was joined by a foreign partner, Shangu, who took a share of 75% in the company. This made the company a member of a major international group and at the same time expanded the opportunities to enter new markets. All formal steps of the transaction of Shangu's entry into Ecol were completed and the final documents were signed in June 2015. Ecol's new strategy with Shanggu was set to significantly expand the amount of contracts, develop the production and supply of steam turbines with output power up to 70 megawatts to the Chinese market, and to combine the benefits of a comprehensive supply of Shanggu compressors powered by Ecol steam turbines. Ecol signed the largest contract in its history for over 30 million euros with the company Kernel, which owns power plants for manufacturing sunflower oil. The subject of the contract is the delivery of six boilers and three steam turbines. This year, complete reconstruction work began on combustion turbines at Net for Gas compressor stations in the Czech Republic, with the aim of increasing the parameters and extending the service life of these machines. In 2019, the turnkey Benkovac bioelectric power plant in Croatia was launched. This was Ecol's first complex delivery in Croatia. In 2020, the turnkey bioelectric power plant Barlinek was put into operation in Poland. This was the first delivery of a complete boiler in Poland. Since then, we've managed to sign contracts for five more boilers for Polish customers. This year, the commissioning was completed of the 40 megawatt power plant for Etihad Food Industries in Iraq. This is the second delivery for this customer, following the previous successful implementation of a 20 megawatt power plant delivered in 2013. 2021 is a record year for Ecol in the number of steam turbines and boilers contracted. In total, there are nine new steam turbines and six boilers. The company has been continually involved in technical development since its foundation for 30 years. In 2015, a specialized R&D center was established, focusing mainly on the development of Ecol steam turbines. The main aim of the center's activities is to maintain and strengthen Ecol's competitiveness 
in particular through increased efficiency and reliability, as well as reduced production time. The R&D department has been gradually equipped with high-quality hardware and software. For example, the current computational cluster for solving CFD problems is equipped with 288 cores. This enables Ecol to solve even highly demanding tasks and at the same time create a benefit for its customers. Ecol can offer steam turbines with expansion efficiency of up to 90% and steam turbines operating over a wide operating range, including ventilation operation. In the future, Ecol wants to continue to focus on the energy sector, especially green energy, and will provide customers with comprehensive solutions and services.